Hey, how you guys doing out there? I'm going to be showing you how to block any program, any application, whatever it is, from accessing the internet, and that's it. So let's go ahead and figure that out. So if you're on Windows 7 or Windows 8, uh, whatever you're on, the idea right now is to find the search function, which I'm running Windows 10, uh, I'm Windows 8 right now, uh, using the shell something, but I'm going to go ahead and type it in there. I'm going to put in Windows Firewall. And you want to find one that says Windows Firewall with Advanced Security. Go ahead and click on that. And let it load up. Okay. Now, I'm going to have to adjust the screen just a little bit here so I get kind of close so you can see what is going on. Just a second, people. Okay, so here we are inside of Windows Firewall. Let's, let's make that a little bit more centered there. That doesn't seem centered. There we go. Now the things that you want to pay attention to is this in the left hand side where it says import rules and outbound rules, okay? Go ahead and click on import rules and we're going to have all these pop up. So what we want to do is you want to go to the right hand side and see where it says new rule, okay? Go ahead and click on that. Next we want to go to custom and hit next. And then we want to click on this program path. Oh, let me get that centered a little bit more. Let me go back and show you in case I could, they didn't see it. So it's going to start out like this. You say, no, I want custom. You want to hit next. You want to find this program path. And I, today I'm going to block Adobe. Uh, because Adobe's... I don't like Adobe uh, spying on me. See, Adobe's in C. And then it's in program files. Then it's right here. And we're going to find... We're going to find addition. And we're going to click on the .exe. Now the .exe is usually represented by the actual symbol in the folder. So... I'm going to go ahead and send it to the desktop as well. And we're going to hit OK. And we're going to hit Open. Now it knows that that's Adobe. We want to stop it from communicating with any outside sources. So we hit Next again. And then we just hit Next. And we just hit Next. And then we go right here where it says Block the Connection. And then hit Next. And this is fine. And name it I'm something. And then uh, la, 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 and hit Finish. Now we block the inbound rules, so now we need to block the outbound rules of the next of the same program. So let's go to new rule. Let's go to custom. Let's go to next. Let's go to this program path. Let's hit browse, and it shows it right there. Let's hit open. Let's hit next, next, next. Block connection, next, and next, and then blah 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 blah, blah, blah and hit finish. And that is how you block any application at all. Some programs have more than one .exe, and if they do, you block both of them. I will see you later. Take care. Bye-bye.